everybody, Merritt and Gaming here, and we're back in the Elsewhere realm for a quick little video. I don't have a lot of time to record today, so this is just going to be a quick little update, honestly. And as you can see, we've got both sides of the large towers for our mining guilds uh, builds. Uh, we've also got the, the two balconies with the, you know, the MG for, for the, the mining guild. Those are the initials for the mining guild. Definitely not Merritt and Gaming. Definitely not Merritt and Gaming. Okay, yeah, still totally Merritt and Gaming. But as you can see, we put one of the two, uh, uh, whatever you call it, brazen, brazen, whatever, the, the, the fire thing, on that one side over here. I'm not sure if it really goes all that well with the build. So if you can, uh, down in the comments, let me know what you think of it. Let's we'll get a closer look of, at it over here. Um, I mean, I like the design overall. I'm just not sure if it fits with you know the fact that we have the amethyst and whatnot. So uh, yeah, uh, let me know down in the comments whether you think we should keep it or if we should leave it off. Of course, that's with that's would be the side without it. Kind of give you an idea. I'm gonna have to thin out that area. Um, to, in order to actually put it in place if we do keep them. Uh, but yeah, let me know what you think. I, I mean, I like it, but at the same time, I don't. And I, j just ignore the, the walkway. I was trying to get a better view of it um, to see if I was going to like it or not. Um, but yeah, there we go. All right. So yeah, we got the two towers built. Um, yeah, and we are going to be building the central structure here and uh, start work on the door. I still don't have honey blocks yet though, so we can't really make the door functioning. Well, fully functioning. I can make the lower portion, like, you know, the like four block wide thing open to where uh, we could still go through, but the rest of it probably would not function at the time. But yeah, let's get down here. The other couple of things I've done, I went and got a ton of copper, which I'll show you in a second, but, uh, I got tired of trying to walk down all those steps, so we've got a shortcut up and down from our storage area, and yeah, we changed the side of where those uh, the stairs are at and the balcony, uh, just because it was easier to put this over here than it was on the other side, because the other side is going to have the largest part of the door mechanism, so there was more room on this side over here where that is at. But yeah, so we got the stairs over here. It also, to me, flows better uh, than it did over there. Uh, we still have, you know, a little bit of a post in the middle to support it. Um, but to me, it still will allow, because we're going to come around, like, right through here with more of the uh, stone slabs. So I still feel like they could get supplies through without a problem. Um, I'm also thinking we may have to do, like, I'm thinking maybe a crane over here to get supplies up to the actual uh the, the actual mining guild because somewhere uh, i'm not sure it's right there that is the area where the bridge that goes across to the shopping district will be in uh in this area so i figure if we put a crane here it could lift stuff up and over and drop it up where the balcony area will be for the uh, shopping district. So yeah, so that is the kind of it's you know a few little quality of life uh, upgrades um, in order to make this a little bit easier to work around and work in. And then yeah, so tons of copper, tons of copper because we use a lot of it for some reason because it takes nine of these to make one copper block. So yeah. And what else is there? I th I think that's it for today. Yeah, this was a really quick one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Nope. Nope. <laughs> we have our little friends. I've started uh, as we're mining, or not mining, as we're going to the two XP farms, the one that has the drowned, because I'm trying to get copper, but I think I have to have a looting sword to get copper. I got potatoes, though, and gold, but no copper. Um, but between that, where I'm getting the heads, and I'm getting the skeleton, or the, all the armor parts from the skeletons, we're adding little guys everywhere we can find to put one. Uh, that way it gives it the area a little bit of character. Eventually, see, look, here, here's another, uh, uh, whatever you call them, drowned villager. 
and uh, my personal favorite, because you know how much I hate chickens in this world right now. Mr. Chicken! Mr. Chicken! Look, he's got a chicken head. Ha <laughs> ha! I totally thought about wearing that as my head. Um, but yeah, and then we've got, I think there's another one. Yep, down here. Eventually what I want to do once we get, once I kill off enough of the chickens and the other mobs to where cows spawn, because the biome that's here should, if I can find the biome, where's the biome? Uh, I can never remember, oh, this is forest actually. Okay, well, I believe it's over there. It's um, over that direction. It's actually plains. So there, there's a spot where it's plains, and I'm trying to get the cows to spawn there, and eventually we'll do leather, and then we can dye the leather to where they can all have the same outfit. But this is our little uh, cartographer guy, so, you know, I kind of put it with the books. Uh, and then our armor is in here with all the rocks. And then there's another uh, drowned villager down by the actual dock. I think we can see him from up here. Yeah, there he is. He's there to greet everyone. Uh, although I, I need to figure out how, because I've seen people do, like, poses with them, but that may take command blocks. So we'll have to figure that out. And, of course, you know, the original villager, Mr. Pig. But anyway, that's probably it for today. Uh, we're starting to work on... Uh, the next thing I'm probably going to work on is the bridge, well, the rest of the mining guild, uh, but the, then the bridge across to there and start trying to get other people to come join us and set up more shops like Sunset Dawn did with his Ender shop. But anyway, this is Meriden Gaming. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and, and don't forget to leave a comment on... What we're, oh, yes, if we're using the Brazier's... Uh, the, the fire pit things or not. Um, I think they look okay, but I really want everyone else's opinion because to me they look slightly off. Maybe it's the color combination. We might do different flame colors. Tell me what you think. Anyway, uh, yeah. So this is Gaming, and I'll see y'all at the Mining Guild.